that's enough. <laughs> <laughs> Hey everyone, so we just got back from Relentless 4. Relentless um, is an event that um, a gentleman by the name of Danny Morrell, he holds uh, once a year. I wasn't gonna attend this year, but at last minute I had the opportunity to go out there with the team and I'm so happy that I did. So we just had the opportunity to take away a whole bunch of really good stuff that we're super excited to be able to uh, share with you guys in our business. I still have to go over so many notes that uh, yeah, I'm still a little bit overwhelmed as to everything that uh, happened this past week. So my main takeaway was just as much of a reminder as it was a takeaway and it was really just opening my mind and thinking about an abundance mindset and you know getting out of the the mindset of always lacking something. So my biggest takeaway from Relentless was um, you know, feeling liberated um, from all the toxicness that I was living with in my life. Um, you know, no longer choosing to live uh, with fear or living in fear and choosing to come from a place of love and abundance. They had some amazing speakers there. Uh, they had Kobe Bryant, uh, which was probably the biggest, um, he's, he was the headliner. And um, to be honest with you, I didn't have a whole lot of expectations um, because I really didn't know a whole lot about Kobe Bryant on a personal level. Just more so the basketball uh, Kobe Bryant is what I am. The, the second thing that I wanted to go in, into a little bit from Relentless was also just you know, driving yourself from a place of love and, and not, letting, not letting fear and anxiety overcome your decisions and overcome what you're doing in life and really focusing on making sure that love is the driving force. You know, it sounds a little bit, uh, sounds a little bit lovey-dovey, but it really, really does resonate with me and, and definitely in the team as well. He gave us a little tip as far as mindset goes. Um, one of the biggest ones that I think and I felt like wrapped up uh, the entire three days, um, just kind of summed up and, you know, very short, short sentence was, um, you know, refuse to negotiate with yourself. Uh, and I think you can use that in business, in personal life, uh, you know, really in all aspects is, you know, refuse to negotiate with yourself. You know, making sure to develop that tribe around you. Um, and I know we hear it all the time, but it's just, you know, in-depth strategies of what to do, how to, you know, make sure that you're putting yourself in the right situations with the right people uh, to be able to grow um, and be happy. I can't go without saying this, that I'm really, really happy that Danny brought us, brought some of the leverage people up on stage, um, you know, the same stage that Kobe Bryant later on uh, spoke on and, um, you know, I got to say, just being able to share my journey, um, you know, with everyone, uh, that was, you know, that was something that I remember going to the first Relentless just as a guest, just, you know, looking at, um, you know, everybody that was on stage and for me to be one of those people now, um, you know, it's just, you know, something that... I can't even describe, right? It was just something that I, I, um, I you know, it was definitely one of my favorite parts of the event. Um, and so thankful that I was able to, um, grateful for everybody that was there to share as well.